How much longer are you going to wait? How much longer? You're going to wait another 30 seconds? You're going to wait another minute? You're going to wait another hour? Maybe we'll, we'll start in a couple hours. You know what? How about I just wait till tomorrow? You're going to wait till tomorrow? You're going to wait another week? You're going to wait another month? How much longer are you going to wait? All great people start. They start anywhere, at any place, and at any time. They start whether they're hurting. They start whether they're excited. It does not matter where they are. They just start. Just start. Just do the work. You just go. And procrastination dies. If you can't control your own brain, and your brain controls you, you're fucked. You have control over your mind. You just have to assert it. Weakness doesn't get a vote. Laziness doesn't get a vote. Sadness doesn't get a vote. Frustration doesn't get a vote. Negativity doesn't get a vote. Your temper doesn't get a vote. So next time you are feeling weak or lazy or soft, tell those feelings they don't get a vote. When that alarm clock goes off at four or five in the morning, your mind says no. You just say, this is what we do. It's what we do now. You got to tell your brain where you want to go and how you want to go and how you want to get there. You don't get better on the daggone couch. You get better by coming out here and getting the fuck after every daggone day. And then once you do this over and over and over again, it becomes like breathing. I don't want to live this lifestyle, but to get to the other side of this, I have to. You have to suffer. You have to make that a tattoo on your fucking brain. So when that hard time comes again, you don't forget it. You have to struggle. The bigger the struggle, the bigger the peace. Expand yourself. Take yourself out your comfort zone. If you stay in your comfort zone, that's where you will fail. You will fail in your comfort zone. Success is not a comfortable procedure. It is a very uncomfortable thing to attempt. So you got to get comfortable being uncomfortable if you ever want to be successful. You have to attack. You have to keep attacking. The enemy has to know he is not going to give up. You must break the soul of whatever the fuck is in front of you. If you keep on attacking something, nothing wants to stand in front of anything that is relentless. But you have to have the will, the heart, the courage to go that distance when you're exactly jacked up. You have nothing left to give and give more. It starts with you. It's about a commitment to you. That's what's wrong with a lot of you. Because you want somebody else to be more committed to you than you want to be to yourself. And you got to get to the point where no other human wants it for you more than you want it for you. Right now, make the decision that any price is worth it for you to make your family proud of you. For you to make your dream happen. Stop negotiating the price. This negotiation you keep doing in your mind. Is this really where I'm supposed to be? Is this what I'm supposed to be doing? It steals all your energy. It steals your focus. But those of you that get laser focused become totally immersed in your dream. That know those babies of yours, your parents. They're worth the sacrifice. Your hardships, your challenges, your situation will either be the reason you don't make it or it will be the story you tell when you do make it. And you get to make that choice.